you know, a couple people pointed out in the comments. We're going to change it. Thank you guys. I just bounce it up there and super curiously balance and I'm just like one of these times I'm going to be like concentrating on something and not notice that thing coming down on my head and then it's hospital stay. I can fix that. I know how to work a stick. Oh, it needs to be longer. Get rid of this little short guy. Got you the hook up now. I mark this and I got to drill this. Oh, he's filthy dirty from being in our garage. This is a vinegaroon. That some people call it a whip scorpion. And they're actually harmless to humans. It's not but... actually a scorpion. Aliens do exist. That is one right this there. This is the proof of aliens right it's here. It's from another planet for it sure. Is. There we go. Okay. So we read every single comment and that's no small feat because you guys are awesome and you guys leave a lot of comments and so uh, but one of the comments we got was particularly useful and that is about this right here so we had mounted it like this uh, in there uh, out of convenience more than anything else not realizing that this vent here would be susceptible to water damage if water got in there it could never get out and uh, one, of, one of our viewers pointed that out to us, very tactfully, I might add, thank you. And it's what, it's the regulator? This is the vent for the regulator, and there's a diaphragm in here, and water would get in there and rot that diaphragm out, and then this would fail at some point. It needs to be this way. We're turning it over right now. Thank you for your comment. And it's gonna go right there, awesomely. It looks like a uterus and fallopian tubes. <laughs> You're such a girl. <laughs> totally. <laughs> Stop girling out this project. <laughs> Getting my estrogen everywhere. <laughs> this is a female propane system. Clearly. Wait till, wait till you see where this bus gets rid of its waste. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> And there's just one unhappy dog over there. Poor me, poor me. Sounds like it's whining about sirens. I know, I just don't hear any. Only he can hear them. Yeah. It's a schizophrenic dog. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Okay, so now, now we got to make this over here out of the way so it doesn't move around there we go and it misses it and that's what we needed it to do all right there it is. Everything's bueno. Everything is bueno. I love when a plan comes together like that. Okay, now Loom. Oh my god, that. It looks like it's gonna untangle easily. And this is the one that goes up through the floor. But I'm doing it first. So I gotta get it to slide a little bit. Oh nice. It's going on super easy. Right till I said that and then stopped. Okay, need the knife. Got it. All right, and that's actually through the floor all the way. So when we foam that up, it'll be, it'll be good. There we go. So now 
now all of our lines except this one right here which it wouldn't have to put a little bit of loom on that is protected from well somewhat protected from critters but mainly protect, protected from the environment continuous water damage rocks flying up from the tires there we go incidentals protected i love it so incidentals don't become accidentals yeah um, right here you can see the loom coming up through the floor right here just giving it great protection and then when we spray the uh foam in there that will just it will be thoroughly protected and a great pass through you had to take the whole countertop off for this. Yeah. So, uh, one of the comments was talking about our gas system down here. And what it was down here is that we had run uh, some rubber hose up underneath here. And I was a little dubious about it, but I'm like, you know, it probably won't get that hot, whatever. But you know what? You know, a couple people pointed out in the comments. We're going to change it. Thank you, guys. Oh, did you already start wrapping that thing? I just wrapped it up. But how exciting. I get to use the flare tool again. Woohoo! <laughs> Bonus! No one gets to use a flare tool as much as I do. Except people that do gas. So we're just putting a piece of copper in here and we use the same flares. In fact, this is leftover uh, copper tubing from the air conditioning install. Plenty of that lying around here now. And we put a angle on the other end of this right here that uh, will hook up to our rubber hose in the back behind the scenes. Did you have to flare both ends or just one end? Um, I flared both and I put in a an entire flare fitting on both sides of this thing. So now this is tightening down really good. There it is. No oh, stop. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> Hand that up to you. Just yeah. Can you get that? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. There. Yeah, screwdriver, flathead. Really? Ow. Okay. That's it. So, ideally, we could just put something to hold that there. I don't think I have. Maybe I can with my fancy drill. Can you hold this right here? It just feels weird. I don't know. I don't have a lot of pressure on it. You can let go now. We just gotta replace these little dudes. Or put them back on. It's dusty. It's very dusty. Probably not the last time. Definitely gonna regret black appliances. I like your drawers, Mike. <laughs> well, I felt like we went backwards for a little while. What do you mean? Just having to take everything apart to redo some of the gas oh, and stuff. And right. Things like that just are totally tedious to me. Oh yeah. Feels like one step forward and two steps back. Yeah, it really does. <laughs> it's our adult style fort and it's cool as shit. It's fun to come here and just see it. Sometimes you get away from it for too long, you get a little discouraged. You just I don't know what it is. It's like a motivational lapse.
that happens when you just don't do something on the bus for longer some X amount of time and then you come back in here like oh god there's so much to do but then you get on it and you start doing it and next thing you know like something new's done and you're proud of it and you're stoked and you want to do the next thing so it's perpetual but still god I want to be done it just keeps going and going and going like I can see the light at the end of the tunnel man but it was a bright light <laughs> Far away. Yeah. Wow, it's really spacious all the way in this thing. I actually consider putting a generator right here, actually. <clears throat> but it just great. is such a grimy place to put anything. Yeah. It's a lot of real estate under the bus. It's just not prime real estate. Yeah, it's definitely a prime. It's like, what are those, uh, the first few spaces on Monopoly? <laughs> the purple. Baltic. Yeah, those purple properties, that's where we're at. I think we just need one more over there somewhere. We have to crawl out. Quit looking at my butt. <laughs> I'm not going to ever stop looking at your butt. <laughs> ah. Ah. I have some electrical line going across the bus right here. I figure since I'm down here, I'm just going to uh, go ahead and make this happen right now. These two have to go together across the bus for some reason. Bring power to the other side of the bus. They're going to travel together in this adventure. They're travel buddies. It probably is. They're not traveling very well on this end. Oh, you know what we could have done to huh. prevent this from happening? Would have tape been to it? tape the end of it. So it wouldn't split open? Yeah. Let me grab some tape. Sure. Is it moving at all? What's going on over here? It's okay if we need to add tape along the line. Oh no, one of the wires is completely out. I That's what I'm saying. Okay, so the idea now is to just, since we're here, this is kind of some unfinished blessingness that needed to happen. Are you ready for that little operation? What, no anesthesia? Ah! Oh, come on now. That's a jerk thing. You're sliding it onto the whole water pipe? Yeah. And this is just to more or less protect it from... This will protect it from bouncing around as it's doing its cross bus adventure. Just to protect this stuff from freezing and better anyway. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> Not wanting to slide on. It's just oh, a, it's too tight. There's a bunch of stuff like all together right here. It's a traffic jam. <laughs> it is. There go. Okay, more noodle. One more. There we go. <clears throat> there we go. Okay, we got that, that, and that. We got some long runs on that side. Yes, there is much, this much grunting involved. Is that what they mean by grunt work? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think so, actually. All right, that one's all the way there. I love it. I love it. I can fit both pieces of tubing in each one. Both piece, pieces fit, as long as I tape it up when I'm done, I guess. See? Oh. 
I see what you're saying. Both water lines in the same pool noodle. Yeah. Or come back. See, this here. Need some support? Yeah. This is one. And then we got to do the one on that side too. Okay. Just to give it some strength so we don't have any. I totally agree. Future problems with this. You need to go get some strap. Would you mind? Strap? Okay, we need strap. We need. I got the. I actually have the screws for this right here. Uh, the driver that has the. Uh, screwdriver tip on it. Oh, and we need snippers too. Thank you for being my gopher, man. You're doing all the work here today. Yeah, I'm the yoga master. You are the yoga master. You're the lawn. My right foot fell asleep a long time ago. <laughs> you need that foot for this job anyway. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's awesome. That is awesome. What a good idea that was, baby. Good idea. There we go. I wish I could reach it. <laughs> I know, right? So I wish you could too. <laughs> oh, I'll get it. Here, 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 here. I don't know if I can start this thing. There we go. You got it. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. Ooh, that's awesome what we just did it's here. really stable. Yeah. Are you still going to put, I like, need to put one on the other them side. together and put little bolt things in? We out? need to. I think we should. I just yeah. don't have anything for it that yeah, I can think of. Yeah, we have to grab some bolts at Ace next time we're there. So the idea here is I don't want to lift this so much as I just want to support it. Support and stabilize? Yeah. Like I don't want it to droop down any further. But I don't want to lift this up and then make it so water can't even get out of this tank very well. There we go. And now it is protected. Awesome. That's cool. I like what we did there. I really like what we did there. I feel better about the whole thing. This is like doing loom, only worse. So it pops off even more. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're almost there. There we go. Okay, I need that. Oh, red tape. Dang. Jesus. The yoga skills are off the hook. Just to make these things tight. All right. I need a little piece of loom over there. That's going on. I'm put, just putting it over the uh, <clears throat> one of the lines going up to the washer. Yeah, just to protect it on the side that's going to rub. And then when we put the um, when we put the foam in these holes, that will stabilize it forever. That's that foam is really something. I know <laughs> it's bomb diggity. After using it on the uh, air conditioning, I was like, oh my god, <laughs> this stuff is uh, more than they rate it at. <laughs> okay. We got a pretty good, I like what we did down here. Like we just want the extra mile to take care of some things that really need to get taken care of. And uh, 
These ones aren't glamorous. They just <laughs> take a lot of work and suck a lot. Okay, so this one right here is our last little thing we gotta see. There we go. All right, that's gonna stay there now. Oh, that's a lot better, man. I wonder if I could do the same thing on the other side, or did we already? I don't think we did. Okay, is that everything on this that's side? That's everything on this side. Everything's shored up and weather resistant. I totally appreciate the comments that we get that help us like take our design or, or build a little bit further and a little bit safer. Yeah. Those are those just make a big difference. Yeah. And, it's great having other people's insight. Yeah. Because we know who our regular commenters. We see you guys. We recognize. We're like, oh, Kevin K. Or, oh, so-and-so, you know. And and uh, and then some random dude will come in there and go, you guys are so dumb. Your house is going to explode. Don't ever teach people to do stuff again. And you're like, oh, my God. <laughs> like, okay. <laughs> and then they get, bad hammer. <laughs> oh, my God. What? <laughs> Sure, I'm glad we came over here. Why? Because I need to glue this pipe right here. It's not glued? No. Shut up. <laughs> it's not even glued? Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> Good work, honey. <laughs> that was a dumb one. But it certainly isn't permanent, so that's good to know. No, but this man. Is, this is the kind of mistake there is no problem. There's no sawing apart and buying new parts. Mm -mm, this is not a mistake. This is just an oversight. Oversight. <laughs> okay, here we go. There it is. There. Yeah, it's high, it, there's a slight downhill to the whole thing. So, I think we're good. Okay. Really, really well. All right. Support your local hip bow. <laughs> you should be letting me do the foam. Oh, here we go. Got it? I think so. <laughs> Just spooges up everywhere. It's okay, as long as it's like blasting down. Like you need to be filling that hole and underneath. Because this stuff is amazing once it dries. It's hard. It is stiff, hard stuff. Where else are we, did I say? Oh, um, we got to go under the bus and do everything from down there, too. Because one of the kitchen ones you can't get to from in here. Right. Okay. Oh, it's definitely coming out there. Oh, Those it is? Good. Good. What about the other one? <laughs> oh, it's upside down. I know. That one's really hard to get to. I think that's it. This is good now. Very good, actually. And that big, the big honker valve is supported. And everything is just like it, where it should be and a part of what it should be doing. Satisfied. I know you're trying your best to hold on to what you believe in, what makes you strong. Mirrors are lying and pictures can be fake. 